As gasoline prices soar across the nation and with spring break just a few weeks away, a lot of people are wondering about what could happen to airline ticket prices. Crime Force Justin, uh, Justin Campbell is live for us outside San Jose Airport with more on if you'll have to pay more for that same seat. Justin. Yeah, that's right. I spoke to a ticket price specialist today, and he says he doesn't expect prices to go up before spring break if you're traveling then. But travelers that I spoke to today here at the airport say they are preparing for a rise in ticket prices. How long are you here for? Um, until Friday. Dawn Wilson landed at San Jose International Airport today for business. She is in medical device sales and travels a lot. I go to Europe, Asia, uh, Mexico, Canada. With the amount of travel and rising fuel prices now, she says her company is adjusting to when they buy tickets. We're just trying to book as far out in advance as we possibly can, plan, and, uh, and see where it goes. Another traveler is doing the same. We about 60 days in advance. But an industry expert says airfare is not rising as quickly as gas prices. First things first, airlines generally buy a bunch of their fuel ahead of time, weeks if not months ahead of time, which means in the short term we're not seeing much of an impact on fares. Willis Orlando is a senior flight expert with CheapFlights.com. He says if the fuel prices do continue to go up, consumers can expect to pay more for flights in June or July, but he thinks ticket prices will remain affordable due to competition from budget airlines. I would not expect anytime soon, for example, though, to go back to the world where one can't fly close to coast for Less than $500 round trip. Orlando says there are a lot of open seats right now for flights to the Caribbean or Western Europe, and travelers are ready. It's fun. It's fun to meet new people and see new places and new cultures and eat really good food. That expert that I spoke to said if you plan on traveling to Asia, expect prices to be high due to limited supply and airlines having to avoid Russian airspace. We're live tonight here from San Jose International Airport. Justin Campbell, Cron 4 News.